and welcome back. We are playing Master Word today with uh, two great people. We've got haha, Matthew Legault and Rob Melvin, both fantastic people that I enjoy playing with. Matthew is, again, the developer of this game. We uh, And we also have the designer of this game, Gerald, uh, in the chat, which is really exciting. So he's watching live. If you are watching live, or if you would like to watch live, I stream every day, every weekday, and I'm happy to have you. We do, sometimes we do game shows like this, sometimes I'm just playing video games where we have Twitch integration, so it's fun. But today, we're playing Master Word, which is really exciting, it's a fun game. We're gonna jump right into this one. I, again, this is not a word that is in the game. I came up with it myself because uh, Matthew down here it knows literally every word, so we need. To, I need to be a little bit careful about. Uh, I, I can't just use a word that's in the game because he's gonna know. So we're gonna jump right in, and the category this round, uh, this game is building. And uh, for round one, we are going to start now. Well, uh, I think we should probably look at where the building is. Correct. Uh, I don't know if we want to. We could say, like, what I like the idea is, like, doing, like, America twice, Canada once, and Europe once, so that if we get two, one, like, two, we know it's there. If we get one, we know it's one or the other. That might okay. work. You know? Uh, yeah. America, Canada, and Europe, you said? Those would be my three. And if we get none, then we know it's somewhere other than those three. Yep, okay. That sounds good. Okay. So the way that this is working is they we have a chat window open. Oh, right, Skype, and America. And so we mm -hmm. are uh, currently going through that. And I'm just copying things into the stream layout so that they can... Uh, <laughs> as I get type stuff in. Well, I guess... Actually, we wanted uh, America twice. America twice. Uh, Nor my second one. Okay. Yeah. America, Canada, Europe. Okay. And America again. So we've got, uh, now that, and we're, we're done with the timer, we don't need it anymore. That was a very quick round. So we've got America, Canada, Europe, America. So this establishes pretty well what, where it might be, especially this one. Oh, where did it go? I have a feeling we're going to get two, Robert. I think so too, yeah. Or zero. And indeed, you did get two. Okay. So, oh, you know, what, what if it's a bridge? What if it's a bridge linking the United States with Canada? Oh no, then it would be three, okay. <laughs> I wouldn't be that mean. I think like that, Michigan knows, the, the people from Michigan know what that bridge is, and no one else. <laughs> <laughs> I had a, my, my, my friend's brother got stuck on the bridge over Niagara Falls because he didn't have his Canadian passport, so they wouldn't let him into the States, oh, no. and then they wouldn't let him back into Canada. So he got like stuck on the bridge <laughs> not knowing what to do. Oh no. By the way, yeah, it's the it Ambassador was... Bridge for all of you uh, at home. Excellent. Okay. I'm a Michigan, <laughs> so it's, I, I know that. <laughs> I actually lived right by the Ambassador Bridge for a year. That was kind of, you know, I lived right in Midtown Detroit. All right, so we're oh, going to wow. start round two. Now that you know that, we're going to jump right in. Okay. So, starting now. What are so your we, thoughts on <coughs> East Coast, East Coast, West Coast, and Central? Mm -hmm. Don't sure. don't hold to be Central, but that way if we get one, we can assume it's West. If it's two, we can assume it's East. Yeah, I think that sounds pretty good. Okay. That sounds pretty good. Okay. Do they're East they're, twice. They're going with just establishing location. Interesting. I think it makes sense. And once we narrow that down, we can go for uh, cities, dates, that kind of thing. Right. Yeah, and this is this is going lightning, Oops. as chat is saying. Right. East coast, east coast, central, and all right, west. Yeah. West. <coughs> all right. Excuse so me. we've narrowed Let's things see how down. It goes. Oh boy. <laughs> so let's see what we get. We're in round two, and we are going to be getting... Uh, two. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Correct. 
Can you put X's on the Canada, Europe, Central, and West Coast? I am happy to put whatever you'd like on. So you'd like to cross Coast off Canada and Europe. Europe, Central, and <coughs> West Coast. Me. All right. Okay. Again, these are marks <coughs> that the guests can remove in the future if they so choose. It's just mm -hmm. a reminder for them. Like, it's probably mm -hmm. not these. Okay, so it's in the east coast of the United States. Um, so I think we can get a little bit more specific and oh, maybe sorry. talk. I, I'm starting the timer now. Okay. Yeah, I think if we look at maybe New York. Mm -hmm. New York, you know, New York. If we're looking at the Empire State Building, well. Yeah, New York, New York, Philadelphia, Boston or something. Yeah, where else could it be? Washington, we... D.C. Mm -hmm. That's true. Okay, let's uh, let's take those four there, and if we get one, we'll know that it's in one of those. Mm -hmm. Or double up again on New York if we think that's the most likely. Yeah, the problem with doubling up though is that we're is that we're losing opportunities for. Mm -hmm. You know, we've got two things that we know, and we've we've gone through two rounds. Okay. So, <clears throat> well, I'm going to do New York City and Philadelphia. Okay. New York City, Philadelphia. Um, should I go with something uh, a little a, a little bit more about the building or should we do you think we should stick on location? Up to you. I think if we spend this to do like Washington DC and one other one, then if we think it's none of those four, if it ends up being none of those four, then we're, then we'll figure out that out. But if we know it's in one of those four, that'll be a that'll be a big help. Okay, Boston, Washington, NYC, and Philly. That's right. Yeah, I think so. All right. Sounds good. All right. So we've got <clears throat> four words built into this. So we're gonna go with. Um, where's my round three checks? We've got round three checks, and we've got a big old one. One. Okay. okay. So we know that it's in one of those places. I would... Maybe. And out of... Uh, and I'm going to use the Joker right now, because <laughs> I feel like this is something that I absolutely need to do right now. So yep. if you're unfamiliar with the game, I... Uh, at any point during the game, you may move one of the tokens on the right side of the screen and place it on a card that you think will help the guessers the best. So I am going to reveal my joker. So normally what you do is you just take this the, the check mark on the right side of round three that I gave, and I just literally move that cardboard token over to the card. But for the stream overlay, I'm just going to do this. I'm going to plop it on Washington, D.C. Okay, that's good. We would have gone down. Uh, we would have, would, have, would have gone running into New York City. Uh, the, mm -hmm. From abandon, I think. That's okay. why I put it there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wait a second. weren't weren't we supposed to be playing this game to put our minds away from current events? I yes, but I also felt it was, you know, <laughs> okay. topical. Anyway. Yeah. Two minute time. Well, We're Washington DC is topical. <laughs> so, let me think. I mean, if we want to get try and get it by round four, which I think would be pretty cool, we need to yeah. probably put White House with a guess, correct? I think that's correct. And then, I mean, we know other buildings it could be, but I don't have a way of narrowing them down without making them a guess. Uh. I mean, the Lincoln Memorial is a building, um, but it's like um, also a statue. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I don't think it, it. I don't know if I would count that as even a building. It's well, maybe it is, but Structure. yeah, statue first and foremost. Yeah, because it's in a thing. Like it's the mm -hmm. statue's there, but it's also in a thing that was built. Oh, I don't know. Uh, the Washington Monument. Uh, uh, isn't the. Uh, what else is in Washington? Is that museums there? Smithsonian, the Guggenheim? I don't know where they are. That I don't know. Mm. It's too bad. I'm in the US for two, non, for two <laughs> non-Americans. 
Uh, so in, for those of you tuning in, you are not allowed to use the internet if you are a guesser. As the guide, right. I can use the internet, but the guessers may not use the internet. That's, that is correct. Okay, so okay. White House seconds. one with a, it being a guess. White House with a guess. Um, then... Okay, well then I'll just write uh, statue. Yeah, that's a good one. I like that. I wrote statue. Prominent. <laughs> Um, I want to submit that. Tw well, we don't need to submit it twice, I suppose. But we don't have our. I'm okay with doing it twice because. Statue prominent. What else? Museum. Yeah. And then uh, what else? What else is in Washington D.C.? We gotta do like even. Yeah, I mean. The UN's in New York. Uh, sure. I'll just put the military. We stole it from the chat. Okay. Oh, that's a good idea. Thank you, chat. Thank you, Gerald. Merci. How many museums are there in DC? That's an excellent question, Seamus. And we're all set to go. So this is the third round. So again, if you were correct with White House, it would appear above my head right now. Oh, well, Did it? it didn't, so that was not a correct guess. Oof. So Oof. I I now have to determine the check marks. And now, I, just to be clear, I, now that we've established that White House is not an, the correct answer to this entire game, <coughs> it now counts as a clue. So the White House might be related to what this building is, so I could check mark, put a check mark as uh, the White House if I really wanted to. So that's uh, not necessarily true, but I'm just saying I could if it would apply. Mm -hmm. And so round four, let's see here. Um, I'm gonna give you one. That is not helpful. I'm going to give you one. We don't know which one it is. Okay. You do well, have two more rounds, so you have plenty of time. So why don't we uh, start the two-minute timer, and you can go right to it. Hmm. Okay. Uh, so, being a Canadian that doesn't know a lot of U.S. buildings in Washington, D.C., the only... The two that I would know off the top of my head is White House and the Pentagon, right? Oh, yeah, you're Canadian as well, Rob. Yeah, yeah. Ah! So... A couple of Canadians trying to just what figure out what's be? in Washington, D.C. Yeah. What better never to been. do than today? <laughs> I thought it would be kind of ironic, and that's why. I hear you. A <laughs> couple, of, couple of Canadians yeah, playing... Uh... Okay, so uh, let me It's the sum up for the White House, because it's like related to that or is it for one of the other three that's the question well i mean ironically everything in washington dc dc is kind of related to the white house <laughs> yeah what's in dc that canada didn't burn down yeah that's a good one james i like that natch um okay quickly uh so i'm fine with pentagon being our second guess and then i'm not sure what the other three would even be i don't even have yeah. Good narrow down guesses. Forty five mm -hmm. seconds. Okay, so you want to use another another guess on Pentagon? I think so. Or we can put military again. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well I'm yeah, I'll do that. And then I'm fine. If you have three others, great. Great shape. <laughs> So we aren't doing Pentagon as a guess? Well, I don't know. Because <laughs> I'm not sure what other building shape will help us with. Yeah, I know. Um, okay. Uh, yeah. Okay, Pentagon's our guess. Military Pentagon. Um, is it... Okay, uh, I'm going to write Monument. Because sure. then we got, the, the, we got the, 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 the Lincoln Memorial is a monument. The Washington Monument. Uh, is a monument, and then uh, offices. Does it have offices in it? Okay. And then I would, I would 
Oh, that's our four? That that's is our your four. four. And time is up, so that's all you get. So. Oh, military was from. Oh. It's yeah, okay. okay. Oh, was it? Oh, yeah, that was from the last round, but that's fine. That'll be our, so that'll be a guess again. Okay, I, I, I thought it was part of that. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. So, uh, for this round, uh, if Pentagon was correct, it would appear right now. It didn't. Oh, oh, Pentagon right. is not the correct answer. So okay. now you basically have one uh, round six, and you've got uh, a one guess in round seven, so uh, still left over. So they only have three guesses total, and they've already used up two of them, so they have one more Ow. guess. And for this round, you got one. Well, it's not like, Pentagon, and it's not how, military. Because it's not even in Washington, D.C. Yeah, like, I, I should have known that. I know that, but ugh. Oh, the Pentagon. Yeah, it's not, eh? I didn't. Yeah, I should have known that. Yeah. It's, it's Canadian trivia time. I was gonna yeah. say, how many Americans know where uh, the RCMP headquarters is? Honestly, that would have been a legitimate guess for a lot of Americans too. It's fine. Well, as soon as you said building, I was worried. You know, I'll tell you that right now. Yeah, yeah. All right, round six. We're gonna start right now. <laughs> Okay, a building in Washington D.C. Hmm. Oh, where do the uh, where do the where do the Washington Capitals play? What's that called? <laughs> That'll be a Canadian guess. Yeah, Is it associated yeah. with hockey? <laughs> <laughs> I have a feeling no. Yeah, they, they change their name every other year as well. It's not like the Forum used to be. You know, the Montreal Forum. It was that that forever. Minute thirty. <clears throat> so what's the what's the what's the kind of the thumbs up for is it for monument or offices i mean to be honest with you i, I hope it is we've only got one guess and there's the washington monument or the lincoln memorial which we both mentioned a couple of times um yeah I can, i'm fine with either whatever I one can. you lean towards okay so what I think we should do then is go all in on the Lincoln Memorial. So let's write uh, like Abraham, let's write statue, let's write large chair. <laughs> <laughs> and then if we get a whole bunch, we'll know it's that. And if we get zero, we'll try the Washington Memorial. Do we get to do a guess after round six? Yeah, we've got round seven okay. to use our last guess. I see, sure. So I've written Abraham. Three on one, one on the other, right? I've written Abraham, I've written large chair. And then, what do we want the other two to be? Uh, p mm, pillars. Four score. <laughs> <laughs> Top hat. Top hat. Stove top. Stove top. He's, not, he's, not, he's not wearing a top hat, but I think we can. We, it's the top hat is implied. I think so. I think when you look at the Lincoln Memorial, the top hat is heavily uh, unfortunately, implied. Unfortunately, time is up, and okay. so I do not have a, a fourth answer provided. So that's going to be left blank. Okay. Uh, and so round six. For round six. Uh, you get three check marks. Woo! Uh, Thank goodness. <laughs> Thank goodness. And are you just going to write your uh, Lincoln Memorial? <laughs> just you need two minutes on this one. I think that will be our guess. <laughs> it's so the be guess really is the Lincoln Memorial, and if that is the correct answer, it will appear Oof. above my head. Right. Now. <gasps> There's a delay. Ding, ding, ding. I don't know. Yes, it ding, is ding. correct. You did get the Lincoln <laughs> Memorial. I figure it was only, uh, you know, it was a good thing to try for this time. It was tough. You got it on the last round, but you did it. Yeah, and you're Canadian, last... so good job, y'all. You took the scene <laughs> of Yes. I figured Woo. it had enough, like identifying features that it would be a decent enough clue to give and yeah. again i while we're trying to avoid doom scrolling i figured why not 
provide a little bit of inspiration for us all here. So, we are going to take a quick break. If you're watching on YouTube, thank you very much for watching. I like and subscribe because that helps people actually do it. It really helps the, the whole thing that I'm doing here. And thank you very much for watching live and providing and support live to these great gentlemen. We'll be back in about four, four minutes and we'll be doing one more game. Thank you very much. We'll be right back. All right.